Mon nom, c'est Lorraine Lavoie de Spiritwood. Aujourd'hui, on va faire de la tire sur la neige avec du sucre brun, de la crème et du beurre. Très bon. My name is Lorraine Lavoie from Spiritwood. Today we are going to make toffee on the snow with brown sugar, cream, and a hunk of butter. And a little bit of vanilla. It's delicious. This is my son Ron, who enjoyed it as a little boy. Oh, he yes. still does. Yeah, even as a bigger boy. And I'm Geraldine. I'm uh, Ron's wife. And it is special to me because I never do, you had uh, snow toffee growing up as a child. But when we came to Lorraine and Amy's family, after supper, at around 9.30 or 10 o'clock, Lorraine would always have a bowl full of snow that she had prepared the day before, and she would cook on the stove the taffy, and everyone would gather around the island, and, and some were, had spoons in their hands ready, ready for the first taffy to hit the snow, and everyone would gather around, Lorraine would cook it, and put it on the snow, and everyone would, of course, just really enjoy it. It was at a the, sweet treat yeah, for at everyone. At the beginning, it's just like a bunch of ravens. <laughs> you get, never gets to set up, but then once everybody gets full a little bit, then it would actually be just nice, nice toffee. You would peel off the yeah. snow. Um, one comment that I think every time I hear Lorraine make it, though, uh, now is, is, but it's just not like cow's cream. Yeah, right. <laughs> right. yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Two cups of brown sugar, one cup of cream. Of course, we used to use cream from the cow, but this is whipping cream. And you turn that on to on heat. And of course, a hunk of butter, which is a big tablespoon. And just keep stirring it until it comes to a boil. One way you can tell if it's almost ready is you, you put some cold water in a cup and you put a little bit in the cup and you shake it up and if it makes a little ball, it's almost ready. Once it starts to boil, it doesn't need much heat to keep it boiling. And you can tell too, you know, if you, if you hold it up like this, and it makes little strings, which it's starting to, see? See? Hmm. So now I know what you do if it goes through the snow, you need to boil it a little a bit, bit more. more. But what if you boil it too much? What will happen? It will harden before you get it poured on the snow. Oh, so it will, it will be in the pot. It will be hard I think you're pretty pot. close to what you had I it right now, so. right? Yeah, just about. Let it go off the spoon. Oh, okay. Yeah, it should be ready now. Okay. <laughs> should be. <laughs> we got there. I think it's ready, eh? See, you can tell it wasn't quite ready. See, that's hardening. Ron's gonna be ready. He's ready. <laughs> I think so, eh? Still not hard enough, maybe? Yeah, it's oh, hardening. Yeah. 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 It was a little too hot, maybe, on this one here. But it wasn't ready. If it wasn't ready, I went back and cooked. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. See, now it's. What if it could stand some more cooking? Where's that little? Try this one. It should come off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We didn't use tools like this at home. We just grabbed with our fingers. Yeah. <laughs> His finger looking good. Might cook and a the little napkins. Bit more. Might cook a little bit more. Think we cook a little more? Maybe. Look. Oops. 
me, I should have bought more brown sugar, made a bigger batch. Nobody would get a taste anyway. And now it's, oh, see when there's a little hole in the snow? It goes down, I think. Are the rest on here? Mm-hmm. Well, you were by, oh! How much I pour? Now I'm thinking that because your mom didn't have maple syrup, because this is traditionally done in Quebec with the maple syrup, yeah, right? Maple syrup. But because you, she moved to the prairies where yeah. there was no maple syrup, you had to brown sugar. You use made your own maple mm -hmm. syrup. So this is kind of a French prairie twist. Here's one. Take, take a little stick, and the way you, uh, you just kind of, kind of, and then you just kind of roll it. I'm not going to be shy. No, oh, go ahead. <laughs> Roll one onto my spoon. <laughs> okay, well, this will be a good one. Yeah, here. And they had troughs. What up? So you want Ah, to die. I did this wrong. Stuck it to my <laughs> Kleenex. Whatever, but so I'm gonna get a little bit of paper with this stuff. Mm. Kind of like the old taffy used to get down. It's very creamy and smooth and delicious. <laughs> it's good. <laughs>